Okay, today we're going to do a demonstration of a time saver uh, wet grinder. This is a 37-inch uh, model or a, a one model 137 uh, with an electronic uh, control for your starting and stopping of the, the drive drum and also the conveyor belt. And that's controlled up here uh, as well as a load meter and a, uh, a DRO for your height uh, of your workpiece, your emergency stop and your power on, power off. And of course over here you have access to the belt. Uh, this machine has a uh, manual raising and lowering of the, of the uh, grinding uh, of the drum, excuse me, a coolant system underneath the machine. It's currently wired for 440 volts. I'm going to go ahead and start up the uh, head now. now. If you want to bring the camera over here, I can show you the tracking. See the tracking still under moving in and out as the belt rides back and forth on the top drum. The safety switch. Okay. And uh, I did jump out that switch on that side door just so we could show that in the video. Normally the machine would shut off if you open that door because there is a safety switch. All right, well that's about it for the time saver. Of course you can go up and down with the speed of the conveyor and you can also change it from here, go slower or faster. And that's about it. Thank you very much. Okay, we thought we would add a demo uh, video for the control on the time saver because it might be something different for some people who are used to the old controls. So it's pretty simple. What we're going to do is we're going to turn it on. And you get your screen up with the model number and the serial number there and the telephone number in case you get stuck. And then you go to the main screen and on this screen, you get to do a few things. You can increase and you can lower the speed of the conveyor. And you can start and stop the conveyor. You can start and stop the, the, drive, uh, the, uh, the, the, the abrasive drum or the air knife and the coolant pump on and off. So there's a lot of little things you can do here. These are all soft keys that you need to press. But every time the machine has been shut down or the e-stop button hit, uh, you have to reset the brake. So it's, it lets you know because it's sitting here flashing down in this lower right-hand corner. So I hit that. Now it's going to allow me to, to hit the master start, which will allow the, the buttons to correspond. So now if I start, hit start conveyor, you see the conveyor starts to go. And the push button now turned yellow, indicating that it's on. So we want to start or stop it. I could press that and then it stops and then um, where is it start the head so that's the grinding head okay thank you very much